We are in uh, Israel once again, and this is a new series of leadership conferences that we're doing. And um, now that we're kind of moving into a shift of our emphasis away from just basic leadership principles in the local congregation to how do we uh, reach the next generation. We're building on what the foundation we've already laid. So one of the challenges, but also the joy, is seeing your next generation become the present generation. Now we're kind of getting a little more personal. We're talking a little bit more from our own personal leadership uh, development in our own congregations. And we're trying to bring some of the messages that we think are pertinent to the season and the time uh, of, the, of the congregation here in Israel. generation to generation. That is really our heart, passing the leadership of the congregation from our generation to the generation to come. I think that we're going to be empowered by knowledge of God's kingdom and power to serve Him in an effective way. I think the most valuable thing that a young leader could learn is to think big and to, to put aside what you think your limitations are and realize that with God, you can really do whatever. So training leaders is being able to really give of yourself. It's not just sharing the gospel, but sharing yourself, your experience, your life stories. And to let leaders know around the world, and especially here in Israel, that what they're going through, hey listen, we've gone through. We want to see everything grow. We want to see the, the ministry grow. We want to see the size of the congregation grow. We want to see your finances grow here in Israel. And we want to see a spiritual growth and development uh, within the leadership that are here. This is a pioneering work here. This is not easy to start anything. We need to really be praying for the leaders here because they have to endure quite a bit to keep moving forward. And so I just have a special heart for our church and back in America has a special place for this, for this nation and we're trying to do what we can to invest in the future of Israel. And I just encourage anybody that is a part, uh, uh, has a heart for Israel to also be supportive. I want to encourage the people that are putting this together, you know, thank you to Maoz and to all the different ministries that are involved. Um, it means a lot when you have leadership from around the world coming and sewing into and, uh, um, and supporting the small leadership that's here in Israel.